Cedar sinai is one of the largest deliverers of health care on the West Coast. We run a large primary care network, and at the same time, we also deliver the most complex, complicated quaternary and tertiary services, programs which really require the highest medical skill and talents in the nation. Cedar sinai has gone through a tremendous transformation. We went from a high-quality, community-based hospital to an academic powerhouse. One of the great advantages we have, of course, is living in one of the most wonderful and diverse cities in the country, and it doesn't hurt that the climate isn't too bad either. We are blessed by a great environment, intellectually as well as personally, and that allows us to have the very brightest trainees who make our chances for continuing to push things forward and innovate even greater. Cedars offers everything you can want in a surgical oncology training program in a hospital that's friendly, supportive, and an environment in which it's a pleasure to train. I knew I was gonna get exposed to every and anything that could possibly be out there to prepare myself for practice on my own. With the way Cedars is set up, it's, it's basically a, a trauma center, but at the same time, it's really a tertiary center that accepts very complex things. So you get both aspects of basic surgical oncology, complex surgical oncology, and then the intertwined relationship between all of the multidisciplinary specialties here really gives you a true understanding and a different approach to patient care. Cedar sinai has practically uh, you know 900 plus beds with multiple operating rooms, multiple floors of 24-room ICUs, with world-class care that's provided in you know, each of those specific areas. Cedar sinai is recognized nationally as one of the top 10 cancer hospitals in the United States. The Department of Surgery is one of the highest funded departments of surgeries in the nation. The experts in surgical oncology at Cedars have so much knowledge and so much experience, not only in running clinical trials, but also in patient care and you know, new and cutting edge research. They're really pushing the limits of what can be done in, in improving patient care, things that you wouldn't even think are possible. Really, the more you prove you can do, the more they allow you to do. And so it's up to you as an individual to showcase what you're capable of. And if you're capable, they let you have almost complete autonomy. There's an obvious dedication to teaching and mentorship. It's apparent from day one they don't try to fit you into a mold. They allow you to pursue your interests and your passions, and they point you in the right direction, even if it's not in their specialty. You have the opportunity on your days off to go out, hike, cycle, be at the beach, be in the mountains. So realistically, it's a, it's a really nice environment in which to train because you get to see so much, and then it's also actually wonderful when you're not in the hospital. If you want to train with world-renowned leaders in surgical oncology, you want to live in an amazing environment with amazing weather and with a wide breadth of different types of patients from basic to complex, I think Cedars really gives you all of those things and that really will make you into a true surgical oncologist and I really think that that's something that's unique to Cedars. Mm -hmm.